So, of course, we need to address the elephant in the room, and it doesn't get much bigger than Tim Tebow. You guys have just confirmed Tim Tebow is going to start with the Binghamton Rumble Ponies, correct? Yeah, it's a, it's a very exciting day for the Binghamton Rumble Ponies organization yesterday. Um, you know, with the New York Mets making the announcement that uh, Tim Tebow will be starting the 2018 season with the Binghamton Rumble Ponies along with the... Uh, the rest of the team that we're really excited in the next few days to find out who it's going to be. So uh, we're ready to welcome uh, Tim Tebow and the rest of the 2018 Rumble Ponies with open arms and uh, get ready for a, a great season that's going to be a lot of fun for us. I love the fact that Binghamton is on the map, that people are talking about Binghamton. I love the fact that, um, I, I and I'm not asking you to confirm or deny this, but I would imagine that pretty much every news outlet is going, going to descend on Binghamton. And I love that we are going to be in the news for something that is positive. And I totally think that we should um, bask in that glow and embrace that. And uh, I know that other people have been asking... Glenn's been getting a lot of questions, yeah? Yeah, yeah the biggest question I've been getting is, uh, is Tim Tebow going to be at the uh, Meet the Rumble Ponies dinner next uh, Tuesday? Um, and I said, I don't know. I don't know if you can confirm, deny, not say, or what you can uh, what you can tell us about So that. can you tell us anything about that? Yeah, it's going to be quite a good opportunity for the Rumble Ponies and the community to embrace this. Um, you know, it's not every day you get someone like Tebow himself, but uh, Tim Tebow, he will be here. Uh, Tuesday, April 3rd, for the Meet the Boys oh, Center. <laughs> Good thing I got my ticket like last week. Oh. You're going to be your chance to try to convince Tim to stay at your house. You'll, you'll show me the, <laughs> the story we have and uh, convince him because you're very convincing. Oh my goodness, I just shared my article about the six reasons why Tim Tebow should stay at my house. I should just point, shared I think, it. I think he asked it, right? He, he, wait, wait, wait. I'm sorry. Could you say no, that no, 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 no. <laughs> he will not be living with you, Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think, uh, too, Tracy, your point, you know, this is going to be really great for uh, not only the Rumble Ponies, but the uh, the community. You know, we're really excited to uh, have, you know, Tim Tebow and the rest of the staff mm, here mm -hmm. and uh, really have, you know, news outlets come out and, and have people traveling all over New York, have Mets fans coming up from the city and people coming from different states because... Right. Binghamton, I mean, I was born and raised here, and Binghamton's just grown so much over the past few years with the restaurant scene downtown and, and everything. And I think this is going to be a great thing for Binghamton. It's a great thing for the Rumble Ponies. Yeah. And uh, we're really excited to uh, have our Meet the Ponies dinner on Tuesday, and then 48 hours later, get ready to play some baseball here. And I think it's also incredible for the other players on the team. This is an opportunity for them to be seen by even more people um, than they, they may have been seen by before. So I think this is just wonderful all the way around. Um, it, I, I think that you'll both agree that this exposure is going to be not only beneficial for Tim Tebow and for Binghamton, but for all of our Binghamton Rumble Ponies. Right, absolutely. You know, I mean, the spotlight is on Tebow right now for being here, but the rest of the team... Um, they get just as much credit. You know, yeah. We're welcoming everyone that's going to be on the Rumble Ponies with open arms. And, um, you know, we, we hope for a good season. We, we're we going to rebuild off what we had in 2017 for our inaugural season in 2018. Just going to make it even better. All right, before we let you go, um, people want to get tickets for the Rumble Ponies and for the games. Uh, what? How do they do that? Where, where, could, where, they, where should they go? Yeah, I mean, uh, so tickets for Meet the Ponies are on sale at our box office. Uh, we're open nine, as well as individual game tickets for all 70 home games this year. Um, so people can stop down and get those tickets Monday through Friday. We're open 9 to 5. As well as this Saturday, we're gonna, Saturday we're going to be open uh, ten to four. So stop on down. Our team store will be open. Uh, we have not only Tim Tebow shirts, we got a lot of great merchandise that our staff has worked hard, uh, especially our director of merchandise, Sabrina Warren, to get it all uh, up in time. Her and her assistant Michael have done a fantastic job as we gear up for opening day. And uh, don't forget, guys, we are going to play as the Binghamton Speedies with uh, Lupos and Felix Roma on May twenty sixth, and we have Speedies gear as well. So. You can get your own points gear, Speedy's gear, and Tim Tebow gear all in one place. Let's job shop. Giddy up is what I say. Giddy up. All Let's right. Rumble. Read, uh, read all about it at 981thehawk.com. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank you.